Hey guys, I'm hunting a new permission. Uh, just picked it up today. Um, the lady was very nice and allowed me to hunt. Said someone had just did it last year, but it was okay if I did it again. So, got a target here. It was hitting a 2645. Dug down and uh, picked up a nail. Now that I've got the nail out of the hole, I'll let you hear it. That's 1144. 446, 1046. So it's cleared up a lot now. Um, I'm gonna just go back in here where I already was and try to get a little deeper. Let's see if we can figure out what this is now that we've got that nail out of the hole. Let's back off that way. Up. Is that it? Some kind of rusty old bolt. Hey guys. Alright, I'm still having this permission. Uh, just got a 1644. I do have a silver dime. I don't know what kind. It looks like it may be a rosy. Can't tell. Uh, yep, gonna be a it's gonna be a Merc actually, guys. Cool. Don't know the year or anything. It's kind of in this thick mud here, but um, I'll get a year on it and clean it up and put it in the video. Thanks for watching. Okay, hunting new permission. Um, so far, I got one wheat and a 50 or 63 nickel. I've got a 1244 here. Pretty consistent 44 on the conductivity. So probably gonna be a memorial or a clad dime. But um, I'm gonna record this just in case. From the 70s, so be back in a few. Okay, got another target. It's 1145. So, dig down, see what we see, guys. It's got a good little tone to it. Just a little bit of a, another hole right here that I didn't make, so I don't know what kind of critter could be living in there. Hopefully you don't come out when we're doing this. I can hear it. Not surprising. Not a good sound to be just a what is this? This could be, this is gonna be a wheat penny, guys, and that was hitting really loud to be a wheat. Maybe there's something else laying with it. Man. We're gonna listen to that again, and that was squealing. Guess it was just a wheat laid funny. That thing was sitting like a silver dime. All right, we'll be back in a few. Okay, digging a wheat penny sound here, sitting at 1240, 1241. Going back and forth, so right in line with the wheat, just a few inches deep. And this will be the third wheat if it's a wheat penny. So I'm hoping here in a minute I'm gonna get on a piece of silver. Definitely wheat penny. That one's actually still got some good detail. Not too crusty like most of them. You guys can see it there. And uh front's a little bit more caked up, but uh I may be able to get a date. No, not gonna happen. But uh, we'll get it tumbled and check it out. We'll be back in a few guys.
Okay guys, this is kind of funny, I know, but I see a lot of people digging them, and I'm actually excited to dig this. It's a uh, Three Mary Widows condom tin. Um, it's pretty rough shape. It's been bent up, you know, beat up pretty good, but it's still a bucket list item, believe it or not. Um, it's just one of those things you see people digging them all the time. You're like, man, I want to dig one of those. But um, pretty cool relic in there. I hear they're pretty old too. I haven't done too much research on them, but uh, I can see the three there and the widow.